last day of the funeral rites of the late um, Queen Mother of uh, the Ashanti Kingdom. And we know it's taking place in Mensha, it's the heartbeat of Ashanti, and we have our own man online. Yeah, uh, well, we, we do have Ohimin Terrier joining us, not from Mensha exactly, but from the Central Business District of Kumasi, uh, because we know that activities are not really ongoing, shops have closed, but let Ohimin tell us what the true state of affairs are right now. Ohimin, good morning, we're grateful for the good job that you guys have been doing. What's happening where you are? Good morning, uh, Mamavi. Indeed, uh, I am inside the Kumasi Central uh, Business uh, District, just in front of the Kumasi uh, Central Market, uh, the biggest uh, market in the whole of West Africa. Uh, notable of the market, this, is a, this should have been a very busy day uh, for the traders who come from far and near uh, to trade their wares inside the market. But unfortunately, uh, they are not allowed to enter the market, let alone uh, trade their wares. Uh, as you can see, the Menchia Palace uh, called for a ban on all shops to remain closed. And all these shops and the adjoining sh uh, uh, shops here uh, uh, have complied to the uh, order or the ban from the Menchia Palace and they remain closed. So it means, as you can see, there's no trader uh, who have come out uh, to uh, 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 display uh, her wares in front or inside uh, these shops. But this is the Kumasi uh, uh, Central uh, Market. Uh, let's see, a few minutes ago, there was a, a security officer uh, deployed by the Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly uh, asking the traders uh, not to even get closer uh, to the entrance, uh, one of the entrances of the uh, main Kumasi uh, Central uh, Market. Uh, his work is to ensure that uh, traders or people who have come to the market to buy uh, something from the market will not get closer uh, to the market, uh, let alone uh, try to enter the market. It has been under key and lock, and uh, uh, for, for almost an hour that I've been here, I've seen few traders or few people uh, who have come. Uh, they tell me they are not aware of the ban, but some of, uh, of them have come all the way from the western region uh, with high hopes of getting something uh, to buy uh, here at the Kumasi uh, Central uh, Market. So let, let me take you a, a walk down uh, the Kumasi uh, uh, Central uh, Market here. This is supposed to be one of the main entrances uh, for the market, but unfortunately, uh, it remains under key uh, and lock. Uh, as you can see, there's nobody uh, inside the market here. On a normal day, uh, this whole area should have been filled with traders. If you want to enter the market, you will find it very difficult uh, entering the market. You see traders uh, displaying their wares, taking over all the pavement uh, 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 pathway here. But unfortunately, today, uh, they are not here. So, yes, the market remains uh, under key uh, and lock. And even here, uh, this should have been a very busy uh, place uh, for the traders uh, to display uh, their wares here. And yes, today they are not here. Why? Uh, because there's a ban on their activities uh, because of the burial service for the late queen mother of Asante Mai, Nana Efiakobi Sewa Ampim. Uh, this woman... A uh, few minutes ago, I had a conversation with her. Uh, she had come with the hope of entering the market, but unfortunately, there's no way she can enter the market. Let me engage her in the, uh, a few minutes of the conversation. Uh, Mami, Marching. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Marching. <laughs> Democracy, <laughs> Now my home say Kumasi so we didn't miss so. So it was Mrebia. Now yes, Mrebia has any people who so bad to wait there. My home say we didn't miss so. Who who so we be tomorrow there? Eh, eh. Then now we what is it? Now we enjoy the meal. Now she in China, she was going to buy a toy there. Why? 
all right, uh, Mama V, this is uh, one of the uh, traders. Uh, uh, she is a potential buyer. Uh, she has come all the way from one of the suburbs of Kumasi with the hope of uh, buying something from the market. Uh, she tells me uh, previously uh, she's aware when uh, uh, bonds are issued or orders are issued, people flout them. Uh, she comes and the uh, market is open. But unfortunately, the situation is different today. Uh, today, uh, she came uh, to meet uh, the market locked. So for her, there's no option for her than to go back uh, to her community, uh, maybe to prepare uh, or wait till tomorrow uh, before uh, she can also uh, uh, come up uh, and trade here. Uh, let me see if uh, probably there's another man who has come here. Papa Pacho, if you hear by and come back, Kumasi Jomha. Pacho, that be me. I see that there be a point, Juma, me fako if you. But me nimsi ya ya too get nimsa. Etika ob ene di awa gwe ne se ngao be fa ha. Me be fa. There be a me point ha se ya na me fa eko fi. Enti me me wa juma mo. Uh, a doom a offense on him if you are. You see, I have two media now. Be you see, mess up for Kwanfu for us. I could pick up with you. Okay, so Mama V, this is also one uh, of the victims of the closure of the Kumasi Central Market. He tells me he has been using this route as a thoroughfare uh, anytime he closes from work. But unfortunately for him today, uh, he came uh, only to see the market locked. So what he will do is to take a detour around the market. So there's no way for him uh, to, to uh, enter uh, uh, the, the market. And that has been uh, the story here. Uh, the uh, people, uh, you know, keep on coming, uh, keep on coming and coming. But unfortunately, uh, they are not allowed uh, to do so. With the help of the uh, security guard here of the Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly, uh, this is the man who has been tasked to ensure that uh, traders uh, 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 don't get closer uh, to the end entrance of the market, let alone uh, try to force their way through. Uh, it's been a, a very uh, difficult and Herculean task for him because uh, once in a while, uh, people have been coming here and he has been uh, shouting and giving instructions uh, to the people. Any part of the world said, okay, i pay to buy our gate in a tomb, Miss Machel and said, Yet and Yadom Baby, and to be any harm. Obit Marco Elko inside and to me, and I asked somebody to call. If you can crack, or be by no, you know, who said, Honor to me, or something that you want to happen to be very effa. Be who said, I will catch it, be no more moon coho, more moon coho. I say, I to me, and can one, I didn't say, I say, I say, I catch it almost a more moon co gate you. And so now, Mummy, and Sabia, or China has severe, you be beer now. Tom Bennett will be, Miss Machel, and you the whole day, young. Right, Mama V, this is uh, also to uh, enforce uh, the, the ban here. Uh, this is the man uh, tasked to also maintain law and order. And be, besides uh, asking traders, uh, the market has been closed. He also ensured that you don't get closer uh, to the main entrance. Uh, so uh, that is a story from Kumasi. And I must say, beyond uh, the, the shops that remain closed, uh, the, the usual traffic that characterizes this area, uh, the, the roads are almost empty. Uh, on a normal day, you, this, would have, this should have been a very busy road uh, for, uh, uh, for, for both uh, uh, vehicular uh, uh, motorists and then uh, also for human. Uh, uh, you could see people competing for uh, space uh, with oncoming vehicles here. But unfortunately, the situation uh, is different today uh, because uh, the people uh, have out here and they are observing the ban on the movement of especially uh, traders and shops uh, in Kumasi. Me, how about the banks? Because I saw one statement that a bank had issued that uh, they were not also working. Do you see that corporate institutions are also open? Yes, uh, for, for the banks, some of them uh, remain closed. For instance, uh, Unibank, 
uh, uh, is one of the banks and access bank they all issued uh, statements uh, to their customers uh, asking them uh, to stay off because today they will remain closed for business. Some of them will be running uh, half day, uh, which means they will run between 8.30 a.m. Uh, and 2 p.m. Uh, MTN, for instance, has also served notice to its customers that its, uh, its offices uh, and also connect shops in the Kumasi metropolis would remain closed. So uh, I would say that the, the bank uh, uh, in totality has been very, very effective. Uh, Ohemi, we have a long way to go, so we'll let you uh, enjoy a little time to have breakfast and we'll catch up with you again. We're grateful uh, for this report this morning. That's our colleague Ohemi Terrier right there in the central business district of Kumasi, uh, where, as he told the story, Roland, the shops are closed. Does it mean that they only totally obey traditional closed. authority or not state authority? Shops are closed, uh, corporate institutions. He mentioned a couple of banks. I think I saw Stan Chats also issuing a statement uh, that the offices there, uh, the bank there was also going to be closed. So, you know, today you have to use the ATMs, but it's just today, right? Yeah, just for today. Just the, but you are a business guy. Um, I wonder, because money will be lost here, right? I wonder how much, if we can... Quantify. Um, quantify what will be what will be lost. It, it averagely has got to do with uh, daily sales and perhaps also what they tend to reckon as um, the, their revenue. Mm -hmm. And then you multiply it um, or add up the number of businesses and sectors uh, within the enclave that will, will be losing business. Indeed, many, many of them have been losing business since the whole ceremony started because yeah. in the evening, you are not supposed to move around very often. Mm. So that's the current state of the way business activities undertaken. For example, yesterday, nobody was supposed to go out in the evening. And Kumase, people take fufu at 6 p.m. Whilst you think that it's a, it's a health problem with mm. starch and all that, um, you can eat fufu at 7 p.m. <laughs> and, and 8 p.m. And even 10 p.m. You can, you can get fufu in Kumase. Um, um, nightlife in Kumase is thriving or has always thrived. Because each time I visit Kumasi, it's in the evening that I get to have the sights and sounds of the city, not during the day. Unlike uh, other places you have to go during the day. Yeah. It's, a, it's, it's a bustle and a hustle of activity. That's true. Uh, and Ohimin touched on the traffic situation as well. A place that should be like bumper to bumper yes. this morning is absolutely looks decent. The only time where he, where he, he, where he was um, that I saw an activity not taking place was when we had the national sanitation exercise starting mm. and uh, Utum for himself was involved yeah. because he said Nana Beba. Mm. So, and indeed Nana came. He came to demonstrate, took the shovels and tried to uh, collect some refuse or residue or silt from the gutter uh, on, into one of um, the, the wheelbarrows for onward uh, disposal mm. or, 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 or put it into the bigger containers. And, yeah. and so they obeyed. But um, it's, it's, it's a difficult thing, uh, Kumasi. The uh, thing is that they love their tradition, they love yeah. their kin, and they want to make sure they, they also revere their authorities. That's there. true. Look at this first woman that Ohimei spoke to. Uh, she heard about the directive, all right, <laughs> but she, she, she decided to still, you know, make her way there. Yeah, she because said, he says that usually. She said, Eya omo kadie, but aya omo nye. So she was hoping that... You know, today was going to be just like the previous well, days the usual. where they would announce that there will be a total shutdown because one exercise is being carried out, you know, or, or the other. And then she will still come and businesses will be operating. And here she is today, mm. gates completely closed down. But we promise you something. There are a lot of pictures circulating on social media about this event, especially on Facebook. So we'll go on to Facebook and then we'll flip through some of the pictures for you to see. Great, great pictures, I should say. Great, mm. great pictures. Great, great pictures. And I'm sure that before the show closes, we'll do all that yeah. for you. Yeah, uh, it's, uh, it's still our continuous coverage of the final burial rites of, uh, of Asante Hema Nana Efia Kobisewa Ampim II. Today is the final day, really. She's going to be buried later tonight. Uh, and there, there's been some, uh, uh, some guidelines, actually. No activities later tonight. This is the night where you should not be seen. You should not be seen. Uh, they're not going to cut anybody's head or anything like that. But one man that Erastus spoke to, was it today, uh, yesterday or two days ago, he said, Oh, <laughs> so, uh.